Hi everyone, welcome back to the Laravel 9 e-commerce tutorial. In this video, we are going to learn about how to create admin product page. So let's see how can we create product page for admin. So first of all, let's create a new LiveWire component. So switch to the command prompt and run the command php artisan make colon LiveWire space directory name admin slash component name which is the admin product component okay now hit enter now run the application all right now switch to the project and let's create the route for this component so just go inside the routes directory then web uh, open web.php file and inside this admin middleware group uh, let's add here a new route so right here route get uh, add the URI admin products okay now let's add here the last name admin product component column column class okay and also set the route name so right here name admin dot products okay now save this file now let's open the admin product component class file so just go inside the app directory then http livewire admin and from here let's open this one admin product component dot php file and inside this file uh, first of all let's import here use live wire with pagination okay this one and now inside the this class just write right here use with pagination and then inside this render method and let's page here the all the products so right here products is equal to model name product colon colon order by uh, created at created at descending okay and arrow paginate and let's set here the page size record in one page now let's uh, return this products to the view so here and big bracket then products arrow dollar products okay now save this file now let's open the admin product component view files so just go inside the resources directory then views LiveWire admin and from here let's open this one admin product component view file and now uh, let's remove this div and then go to the admin categories component .php file and from this file uh, let's copy this div okay copy and paste here Okay, now change here the text products. Okay, all products and also remove this link. And inside this table, let's uh, change here the table headers. So, just to display here the product image, so right here image, then name. Uh, product name and after this uh, let's display here the stock and uh, after this price then categories
then display here the product creation date okay so just write here date okay now here inside the t body just select this and press ctrl plus t okay and just write here products Pro and inside this for each products as product After this serial, uh, serial number, let's display here the image. So, write here img tag src and inside the alt tag, just add here double curly bracket and display here the product name. Okay, and also set here the width. Uh, it's a 60 pixels, so just write here 60 and now close this img tag okay for adding the image src image url uh, let's go to the sub component view file and from here let's copy the image url okay and paste here Okay, now let's display here the product name. So just change here product, product, arrow, name. And here after this, product, arrow, uh, for displaying the stock, stock, underscore, a status. Okay, now let's copy and paste here. And display here the price. So right here. A regular price and after this just to display a category and then display the date creation date so right here created at and now just remove this link okay and here for displaying the category name uh, first of all go to the product model so just go inside the app directory then models and from here let's open product.php okay and inside this model class let's create here a function public function and function name category and inside this just return dollar this arrow belongs to and add here the model name category okay and also import here the category so right here app models category okay then colon colon plus and after this just add here the column name which is category underscore id okay now save this file now here inside this table uh, for displaying the category name uh, just write here product arrow and then this function name okay category so after this just write here category and then uh, let's access the column name name so right here name okay and for the pagination link uh, just change here the just right here products okay products arrow links now it's done okay so save this file and uh, now let's add the link uh, inside this menu okay I'll just add here the link so go to the layout file so your directory and open app.blade.php file okay and here is the admin menu and inside this product link uh, let's add here double curly bracket the route and add here the route name admin dot products okay now save this file 
and everything is done so let's, now let's check so switch to the browser and refresh the page okay now go to go to the products okay so just click on products and here you can see the products okay you can see here the 10 products in one page and if i click on second page you can see here another six products okay there are 16 products all right so in this way you can create the product page for the admin so that's all about creating product page for admin so thanks for watching this video and if you still have any kind of question you can ask me in the comment box don't forget to subscribe my channel thanks for watching